Gold forecasts are crucial level for gold. The technical analysis for this pair obviously is very bullish, despite the fact that we have seen a couple of really ugly negative candlesticks over the last couple of weeks. The $2,300 level, of course, is an area that previously had been resistance and is now support. And beyond that, there are reasons to think that the market has support just below near the 50-day EMA, which is near the $2,250 level. Obviously, we also have the $2,200 level underneath that could offer support, so it all ties together quite nicely. If we can take out the top of the nasty candlestick on Tuesday, that would obviously be a very strong sign as well, and it could send gold on a path toward the $2,400 level above. The $2,400 level, of course, is a large, round, psychologically significant figure and an area that would attract a lot of attention in and of itself. I think at this point in time, gold is essentially a buy on the dips type of situation. Of course, the biggest question is where is that dip that you'll be buying at? Ultimately, I do think that we will go higher eventually, but we have a lot of questions to ask in the short term. After all, keep in mind that there are a lot of geopolitical concerns out there. And of course, there is a lot of concerns when it comes to the massive amount of spending coming out of the United States and the Biden administration. Adding $1 trillion worth of debt every 90 days is not exactly fiscal responsibility, and therefore gold could be used as a bit of a hedge for that as well. Thank you for your watching. If you're in need of an activation key for Office, Windows, or if you want to safeguard your device with top-notch antivirus software, head over to buffcom.net. Exciting special offers are just waiting for you.